how's it going there? My name is Sam Bowden, and welcome back to another episode of Telltale Games The Walking Dead Season 2. I literally almost said AMC's The Walking Dead. I really, I probably should just say that just to get out of my system, but, um, when we last left off, uh, we met, we woke up at the riverbank, Clementine did, Krista's gone, I'm pretty sure she's dead, my guess is she's dead, I don't, but, I don't know. Um, we met a dog, who unfortunately, who named Sam, who unfortunately ended up biting us and we had to kill him, because he got stuck in some rebar, and it's really sad and I hated it. We met some people, and now, and they locked us in a shed, because they don't know if the dog bite is a walker bite or not, and now we have gotten out of the shed and we are looking, trying to get into the house to find stitches and stuff for our arms, so let's keep doing that. We, I think we might be on a little time limit here because maybe the plywood because there are walkers about. Get in there. What is this music? House meeting in five minutes. Set. It won't take long. There's a few things we need to discuss. Fine. Trap door. <laughs> I want to make noise by banging on it. Oh, shit. Hammer's better for walkers anyways. Hammer is a lot better for walkers anyways. You can bash their brains as well as stab them. Well, Luke has more to say, I guess. Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of this. She's gonna... I'm gonna get found. I wanna listen a little bit, though. Bring her in here? No, I'm just saying it wouldn't look too good. It's just a protection All right, let's back out. Medical supplies. I don't care about the poster. I'm going to run into Sarah, aren't I? Oh, and I'm back in the- Oh, I am! <laughs> Shit! I didn't want that. Whoops. I didn't want that. My bad.
and I have to go upstairs. Someone's gonna be in the bedroom. This first bedroom I choose, I bet. Shh. You're not supposed to be in here. Hi. Can you please help me? I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. Okay. Help me, and I won't tell him. I... I'm hurt. Please help me. I, well, I shouldn't. What happened to you? A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurts. Yeah, it hurts! I could die if I don't take care of it. Do you understand? I need something to clean it with, bandages, and I need to sew some of it up. It's too deep. My dad says we're out of real bandages, but I know where to get something to clean it. That's what this applies. I'll help you. Thanks. Thank you. Sarah. I'm Sarah. I'm Clementine. We're friends. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. Sure, we Yes. Friends. We are friends. Promise? It's important. Friends have to trust each other, no matter what. Yes! I promise. Me too. Friends. Oh, for fuck's sake! And <laughs> at some point, I'm gonna have to, like, betray her, I bet. Pinky swears forever. God, you are so bad. If I can find the stuff my dad uses when I get a gun. Let me look around. I think this is it. That'll work. You can't do it here, though. Someone will find you. Don't worry. I won't. Jiggle, 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 jiggle. Okay. Thanks, Sarah. Okay, so I have peroxide. Okay, there's a sink. There might be stuff in here. <clears throat> Needle. Clean. I'll still need some bandages, though. No, there's nothing in the shower. Please don't come in the shower. This might have been a really bad idea. Damn it. Just need to have this baby. <laughs> Let it be okay. Let it be his. Ooh. Got a little cheating going on here. I should have chosen those just to I it would have been the smarter choice. Is it getting red? Don't 
don't put V in there. No one put V in here. The chess board. No, wait. There might be something in here. Oh. I was wrong. Rags. Not exactly bandages, but they should help stop the bleeding. Oh. No. I'm not being an idiot. I'm not going to be an idiot. Are you kidding me? I'm still going to get caught. I know how this shit works. It's really loud steps. Damn, Clementine, you have learned to survive, haven't you? Lee has taught you. That's gonna hurt like a motherfucker. This is gonna suck. Yeah. I know how bad hydrogen peroxide hurts. Hydrogen, hydrogen peroxide. <sighs> Man, that stuff. That stuff hurts if it's a big wound. Now, just like last time, just how Crystal showed me. Hard to listen to. Oh, I can't do this. I can't watch. Oh my god, this is so bad. Oh. I can't watch this. Glitch is going on in it. Oh my god. Am I done? Oh my Oh my god! Are we done? Please tell me that's over!
Oh my god, that was horrible. Oh shit. Yep. You can't. I saw that coming. Okay, yes, this. There's my mouse. Fuck off! Fuck off, you son of a bitch. Hammer! Second time? Third time's the charm! Okay, fourth time. Still. Not. Bitten. Holy shit. What the... Hell didn't get in here. Little girl's tough as nails. Are you all right? I'm still not bitten. I never was. And you left me out here to die. You patched yourself up? Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from us? This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. I did. I took stuff. And I'm sorry. I really am. And you think you can trust her? God damn it, don't even start. Any of you would have done the same if you were half as tough as this little girl. So just save it. Yeah. Fuck off, Bring you little bastards. And I'll take a look at her arm. Oh, now you will! Look, sneaking around out here. We better get inside. You hungry? No, oh, I thought I was gonna choose. Thanks for patching my arm, dick face. I'm gonna kill that one this first. Might hurt a little. Ow. Yeah, How I just look? stabbed myself Her four times. Skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So it wasn't a lurker bite. If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. What's your problem? I'm killing you first. I wish you wouldn't have done what you did. I was hurt, and you weren't helping. Because we considered you a threat, which you were. Was not. Maybe you still are. No, I'm not. We put you in that shed out of concern for the safety of our loved ones. And then you escaped and persuaded my daughter to steal from us. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially. But once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. I already figured that one out. how bad the world is. What is really like out there? She would cease to function. She's my little girl. She's all I have left, and I would ask that you stay away from her. I'm sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. You're forgiven. Just don't make any more mistakes. And after I pinky swore and everything, you can't break a pinky swear. Are you kidding me? Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. What's your name, Alvin? I like you. That's gonna leave one hell of a scar. Better than losing it. Now you can say that again. Scars? They're way cooler than stumps. Why is it what? a little blurry? Nothing. 
I just had a friend who lost his arm once. That's all. Hi, dick face. Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry for for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro, and that was aggro. definitely not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. You were just protecting your friends. I get it. Well, I didn't mean to be so harsh. I'm still killing just... you first. <laughs> we had a bad experience once. What happened? Nick lost his mom. We took care of someone who got bit. It was my fault. I... It was no one's fault. We thought we could control it, but we couldn't. And then she turned, and his mom was standing right there, and she got attacked. And there was nothing we could do about it. Anyway, hopefully you understand. I do. Yeah. I'm still killing you first. Maybe the woman, though. Maybe Unless I want to kill the woman first. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I'm thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. If you let yourself heal up, take some time to sort things out. Thanks. Do you think everyone else will be okay with it? They'll just have to deal with it. So, what happened to your parents? If you don't mind me asking. I mean, I assume what happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. Other people took care of me, if that's what you're asking. I was just curious on how you made it this far. I just Lee. tried to stay with good people and not do anything dumb. Hey, I'm sorry. I... I shouldn't have asked. My parents went on vacation and left me with a babysitter. And they never came back. We went to Savannah to find them, but they were already dead. Wow. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we all tried to make it, but it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. He's the reason I keep my hair short. Oh, she moved what? that particular... Uh, happened to him? I killed him. He got bitten, protecting me. And I had to kill him before he turned. Wow. I had to. And also, I kind of told you to kind of do that, too. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch, and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in anyways. Now get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. A couple fresh brookies for dinner? Mm -hmm. Wouldn't that be nice? Brook trout? Is that what they're called? River trout? You're still here. The hell do you want, Preggy? I wouldn't get comfortable if I were you. I would fuck off if I were you. Luke invited me to stay. Good for him. But 
that's not how things work around here. We make decisions as a group, and you're wearing out your welcome. I should have asked who's the you baby. You got what you came here for. Now go. I should have asked who the baby is. This is a good time for me to stay, save it and leave this episode here. Which is what I'm going to do. That's a perfect time to do it. End of a scene. Very intense. What kind of intense? Very gory and and um, emotionally, psychologically disturbing episode. I did not like that particular one that much. The 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 thing is, it's difficult for. It might be less. It might not be as bad for you guys watching it, but for me, I have these on, and if this blocks out even my voice talking, like right now, I can kind of hear myself talking. Not that very well. I know I'm saying stuff, so I, so I can hear myself. But when I'm playing the game, I can barely hear myself. T I can I can feel myself talking through vibrations more than hearing myself. So, I'm hearing everything. I'm hearing all the gore sounds. I'm hearing Clementine crying and everything. And that was a very psychologically challenging episode for me to go through it was that was harsh but the game is still amazing thank you all so much for watching if you liked it please smash the little like button down below leave a comment down below what you thought of this episode or and what you want to see next on the channel and that is all for today thank you so much for watching i will see you in the next video take care now bye bye This turns the ladies on. Yeah, just kick those eggs out of the way. Um, the towel's right in the middle. All that. Wizard Towers protects it's fairly out. The uh borders protect most of it. The expos cover pretty much 